and you talk about what you learned from that past experience and what you will do in the future. So if it's our question, like uh, are extended families good for children? Extended families are bad for children uh, because, you know, it, the house is too crowded and it's too stressful. For example, uh, there's a case of a boy who uh, was getting bullied at school, but uh, his uh, extended family was at home and they didn't listen to him because there it was just too busy. So he uh, killed himself. In the future, right, and you talk about what you learned here, okay? So in the future, I will have a small family so that my kid, my child, uh, doesn't uh, get depressed and he, they, they feel they know that they can talk to me and I will listen to them or so that I won't be too busy or they won't be afraid of whatever. In the future, I will blah, blah, blah because of the past, all right? That's how you get band nine, all right? And then the last step, step five is uh, what should everybody do? So people, society, my country, right? I think people should cut, cut, uh, separate from their families uh, whenever they can. I know sometimes you have elderly family members and you need to take care of them. So people should care for their elders. But uh, if they have younger members, they should help them be in, right? Should, should, should. What should other people do, right? That's the five steps. And you need to try to use a cup, not my cup of tea. All right. So I tried to talk for a minute. Uh, so you can have some time to make your notes. If you're ready to go, let me know. Just go. Who's ready? I know a little bit of Vietnamese. What is shut? It means to close or close. So the window is closed. The window is shut. The door is closed. The door is shut. Shut means closed. We are what we. So Thai down Vietnam. Uh, I'm not sure what that means. Does that mean when did I come to Vietnam? Three years ago. Nobody? Yeah. Where are you now in Vietnam? Not when. Oh. Okay, now teacher uh, Vietnam. Uh, Adal. Okay, I see. <laughs> I'm in Ho Chi Minh City. Thank you for the clarification. Thank you for the help. You wrote shut. S-H-U-T. You got it, we. But I'll, I'll give you a quick example. I'll write a quick example. In, boo, way, come on now. Give me your answer. Let's go. Jump on it. It doesn't have to be perfect. This is practice. It's okay. Okay, I I will start right now. Go. All right. So, uh, in my opinion, uh, living in an extended family is uh, very beneficial for children mm -hmm. uh, because uh, you know living with uh, many generations. Uh, give give children some you, you know some some cares. So I mean that family members uh, may take care of together. Uh, for example, uh, the old 